Hello, everybody, and welcome to Inspiring Change, the interview series with the members of the Wellness Universe, where we get a chance to find out a little bit more about them and see what makes their soul smile. So our first guest today is Bahavia Gore. Hi. Hi. How are you, Sherry? Good. Thank you so much for being here and being part of the Wellness Universe. Well, thank you for having me. It's it's an honor. Thank you. Absolutely. So why don't we jump right in and you go ahead and tell everybody what your Facebook page is and what your mission with it is. Okay. So my page is Bhavya Gore. That's B-H-A, V as in Victor, Y-A, G-A-U-R. And then there's a little, um, like a swirly kind of a hyphen. <laughs> and uh, it's Kindred Souls. So that's K I N D R E D S O U L Z S. Um, my page, wow, it's like a little baby that I have and it is growing with me. The page is all about hope and inspiration and motivation. Um, like, you know, every one of us, I have been through the roller coaster of life. And um, unfortunately, during those times, we feel we are alone. We feel we cannot talk to anyone. But believe me, all of us are going through the same thing. It, it is similar, not exactly the same. But um, the underlying lessons are pretty much the same. So I'm just trying to share some hope and joy um, because this is something I have learned uh, as I have grown. And uh, just sharing these messages of uh, hope, faith, joy, wisdom, and I also do Akashic Records, so a lot of uh, the times I get some, you know, like downloads, so as to speak, of uh, or channeled messages and stuff, so I go with that and I, I try to share that, because every morning it feels like there is something new that I'm asked to do, and I know there are people out there, so those messages are for them, um, so I just put it in a nice uh, poster form, you know, making it attractive for the eyes, like right, I can't right, right. try to do that. That's it. So yeah. perfect. So <laughs> is has that always been a part of who you are, wellness? And so basically, is wellness part of you always? And what does wellness mean to you? Um, not in the beginning. Like you know, we all think that we know what we are doing and everything. But as I grew, I learned that uh, wellness is all about our inner and outer universe. So if our inner universe is at peace, that is what reflects in our outer universe. So that is what my journey has been. I literally have uh, rediscovered myself through uh, the tough terrains of life. And, um, you know, that's what life is about. It's right, a right. lesson after the other. It's a big uh, earth school. Yes, <laughs> absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. So what I talked in the beginning about what, you know, stirs your soul, what makes you tick, what actually inspires you? Well, it's something very simple. <laughs> I don't have something big to inspire me, but I think it's the it's the ground root of all. Love inspires me. And, it's huge. Uh, <laughs> and I have been touched in so many ways with so much good. So there is so much good out there, so much good in humanity. I have been held by complete strangers, you know, uh, when I moved to a new country and, you know, separation and divorce and, you know, whatnot. So uh, I've been really helped and that is what uh, really makes me so happy and, you know, very humble as well because we are a minuscule part of this huge universe. And, you know, if we're thinking about ourselves, we think, oh, I'm, you know, I'm this person and I'm this big. But if you look at it, we are just a tiny little part of it. And just being able to be a part of that and seeing so much goodness around. I think that's what makes life beautiful. It's so it's so inspiring because a lot of people don't take the time to see the goodness. You know, and, and when you step back and you allow it in, you do really see all this beauty around you and that is inspiring. So I think love is a huge answer and everything, as you know. Yeah, and you know, if you look beyond whatever people are doing, their actions and all that, the base of everything is love. Right. So right. it's just, um, and I have, you know, with time, I have learned to see that. So um, I would love to share something here that one of my Reiki masters, when I started on this journey, I think it has been over 25 years uh, when I started on the journey. And then, you know, I heard this thing and that stayed with me. So I remember she said, the rag pickers will only look for rags. 
which is so true. If we are looking for good in everything, there is good all around us. Yeah, it just yeah. depends on what we are focusing on finding because that is what we will attract. So Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> so one last question for you. So you obviously spread this beautiful message on your page and with as many people as you can. What happens if someone waved a magic wand and said, you now have the whole entire world listening to you? If you were given that chance to share one message, what do you think that would be? That would be believe in yourself. You are like everyone else. It's not as if somebody else is better than you. So don't hold it back. You have the divine spark in you like everyone else. Let it shine, let it shine because you never know who you might be guiding, who you are shining for. So it's just, just, you know, let it go. It's just so, <laughs> just beautiful to surrender and just be yourself. So perfect, this is perfect. Amazing. Where can people find you so they can feel your love? So I do have a website, uh, which is uh, www.kindredsouls.com. And again, the Kindred Souls has a, a Z in it <laughs> with the Z. And I also do uh, Akashic Record workshops. So literally at the beginner level only, you not only lo no learn how to access your records, you also can start accessing records for other people. It's a very simple way of doing it. And I do have, I do workshops all over the world. Um, I would like to do in more cities, <laughs> <I'm not laughs> but definitely in Canada. Um, I do it in uh, San Diego and um, LA. Also in Ireland, in UK, in different cities in India. And this year, um, Australia is also awesome. coming forward. <laughs> awesome. Well, people have a chance to see you all over the world. And now they have a chance to see you here as well. Thank you so much for being here today with us and all the work you do every day. Oh, thank you so much, Sherry. I'm really humbled and honored to be here. Thank oh, you. Thank you.